Is that? Yo, it's GSM Cribs. Holy crap, what's up? You caught me at a bad time. Oh. 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 This is my oops. This happens to be my 2008 uh, town and country Chrysler. It's a view. This cap that still works. Wheels. Top notch Firestone wheels. Look at the trend. Look at how the rims they shine. There's a couple of foot marks from the other night when I got pissed at my best friend. Permanent indentation of history being made. Here's another one. This got into an accident with somebody at a bank. And it's got its next here's another foot mark right here. See this? Look at all the handles at work, all the windows work. It's even got this feature. So no numb nuts hit your fucking car. This, same knife from the boots. I got mad at my best friend. I must have hit this three, four times. The result, stupid me. That's what it sounds like. Sounds great, right? I was on the LIE. Uh, maybe five months ago, I don't know if you can zoom in on that crack. The thing started about this big because of the heat. It's, I don't know if you can see it. it starts here and it curves up and down and ends up over here. This thing's hit many trees. My radio starts pausing out like I'm being abducted by UFOs. This I think someone hit me when I was parked somewhere. Beautiful, huh? All right, so you've seen three quarters of this butte. Now, I want you to follow me to the back. So, here's what I got in the back, folks. Got the light. It's got a TV way back there that pulls down. It's got the climate controls behind the TV. It's got all the vents. All these, there's too much stuff to lift it, but all these come up. And on the floor in front of the back seat, on the floor, there's baseboards that pull up. I got shit storage in there, but it's all like for your car fluids and shit like that. Jumper cables for football, a body. I'm only kidding. Anyway, so getting to what I got in here. So I got basically my mop bucket. I got this thing to rinse it out. I got the big pail in the back that basically has all the basic cleaning stuff. Times I go crazy, you know, I smoke too much weed. I sit in this and I, and I go, ah, to the parking lot with it. Uh, some other shit I got here. It's the new fishing pole. This is a 10 foot ugly stick, $100. Difference between this one, the private based on Walmart is, these eyes are like plastic and glued like shit. So after a year, Walmart, you know, they jump. But this is a $100 ugly stick. The reel, a Sapporo reel, which was bought years ago. It's about an $80 reel. With, with 40 pound braided line, not mono braid. It's tougher than the regular stuff. So, hey ladies, look at my rod. Ah! So now that you've seen the whole exterior and from the back interior, take a close look inside. My fish and tackle box over there, closed. Very special, my bed, closed, more clothes and clothes. And miscellaneous shit in there. Books, all that, wedding photos of the past, my umbrella. Oh, so here you have it, GSM Crib. You saw me, you saw the crib concurrently, baby. What more could you ask for? So yo, motherfuckers, I'll see you later. You have a good time. And remember one thing, you're not God, my father, or my boss.